Hello, my name is Dr. Perry Berry, the superintendent for Queen Creek Unified School District. And like the town of Queen Creek, we have a rich history. So we're gonna take a few moments to look over the years into our past as we move toward our future. When I picture Queen Creek, I remember it like it was when I lived there. It was a, a farming community and a more rural community. For the most part, we, we were able to set our calendar up a lot of times with the crop season. From 1925 to 1982, the district was made up of just one building. That building is now the Santan Historical Society Museum. Many of Queen Creek's founding families and current residents actually sat in these desks. The people that's come and the people that were here have always supported a good educational system. We had a different type of teacher, a very loving, sweet teacher. She had eight children of her own. <laughs> and she drove out from Mesa every day. As a kindergarten, I went into the historical building, went there up to fifth grade. Our kids started kindergarten here, and they, that's the, they went to the Historical Society for kindergarten. In 1982, the district moved students over to what is now the site of Queen Creek Middle School. The date of that move is still written on a chalkboard in the museum. Where you see the school bus coming in, that, uh, at, that at one time when I first got on the school board was Quonset huts. So th this building here was our, our cafeteria. Right here where this new cafeteria sits was nothing but parking lots. And this G building was used to be the Queen Creek Elementary. Even the district office was here, so whatever Queen Creek had, it was right here at this site. And we built, when I first got on the board, uh, was a gymnasium because we had the kids had no place to play. We had to kind of build it little by little as we as we were trying to grow. I think as, as the area grew and you had people coming in from other parts of the United States and other parts of Arizona, they didn't think much of having to bus kids a half hour each way. Because the community had really started to grow and we, we felt like it was time for us to start our own high school and start our own traditions out here. So we developed the Queen Creek Unified School District. Today, we are a unified district serving students up to the 12th grade. That decision was driven by growth. I, I don't think that the people in the town or the community realized that it was gonna grow so fast. Since our traditions revolve around community and family values, it is no surprise that so many students and families have returned to Queen Creek to work for the district, which makes us the largest employer in our area. I worked then from, for 19 years teaching. The schools continued to grow. We took on the high school, and so I was teaching from second grade through, through the 10th grade. I started working for the district at 1985. I've been working now 23 years. I plan to stay here until I retire. I've been in the community for 46 years, 47 years. I've been an employee of the Queen Creek School District for 27 of those 47 years. I was attracted to Queen Creek because it's a growing, booming district. There's a lot of opportunities out here. It's a family-oriented school district. In addition to that, the community really values education. It's awesome to see, you know, starting from this small little community with one little school, to see where we've grown and where we've gone. What really drew us to Queen Creek other than the schools was the community. Fast forward to today. The town and district are still growing, and that growth is a good reminder of where we came from and the values we will uphold moving forward. I have a lot of pride in this school because I understand the roots and the traditions that were started here. It has a great foundation. We have great employees, a great staff, a great student body here, um, and it's just really a great thing to be a part of. We are, we're moving with the times. Um, we're getting bigger, but we're also being progressive. We're adding more technology into the classrooms. We're um, developing new programs to help our students be more successful. We're the, we're the district really to, to watch in the East Valley. We'll soon have our second high school, which nobody ever dreamed of that. Queen Creek is just an amazing place for people to raise their families and to educate their children. Our children is, is our future. In closing, I would like to thank all of our founding families and our future families for making our community and our school district great. In preschool through 12th grade, we are committed to providing high quality educational services for all of our students and preparing them to be tomorrow's leaders.